Well, the Idaho Steelheads picked up their ninth straight victory on Wednesday night as they returned back from the holiday break, and they did it in pretty dominant fashion, a 6-2 final over the Utah Grizzlies. Tonight, it's the fourth of five consecutive meetings between the Steelheads and the Grizzlies. The face-off coming up here at 7.10 p.m. Cam McGuire standing alongside Steelheads head coach Everett Sheen. Well, Sheen, we just alluded to that Wednesday night, a nice little victory, and you picked off just where you left off heading into the holiday break. Yeah, we, we came out flying. Uh, you know, I thought the first period we, we kept it simple, got our legs into it. Uh, we hadn't skated since break. Uh, you know, we got a nice power play goal there and then rolled that momentum into the second period. And, you know, I thought we played a pretty complete game other than, you know, about a minute and a half stretch where we kind of got wrapped up in some emotion. But uh, I liked the game overall. Power play has been clicking all season long, had been held off the score sheet the last two games, but you got rewarded Wednesday night with three of them. That had to feel pretty good. Yeah, it's a big boost for those guys. Uh, you know, to go three for four on any night is is huge. And, you know, they were working hard, uh, running kind of our structure. And, you know, a couple of them came, you know, off rushes at the end of, you know, four and four play. But, you know, we'll take them. We mentioned uh, nine straight wins. I want to ask you about it. Obviously, we've talked about this streak, but I want to ask you about goal scoring during the streak. 46 goals during that stretch. Scored six goals in three straight games. How have you been able to sustain all the offensive pressure? Well, I think it's mostly looking after our end, um, you know, when we're not in our end, we're obviously in the other end, and that's where you score the goal. So I, I thought we'd done a tremendous job buying in on the de defensive side of the game and, you know, allows us to have the puck and let our skill work. And, you know, we got guys that uh, can finish, so it's, it's been good. It's been a milestone week for veteran defenseman Matt Register, who picked up his 300th career ECHL assist Wednesday night, and tonight he'll play in game 500. That's a pretty neat accomplishment. It's incredible. Um, you know, I think... We found out earlier today there's 12,000 players that have played and only 45 have reached that milestone. And, you know, for Reg, uh, I saw him play his first ECHL game and now I get to see him play his 500. So it's, uh, it's been a cool journey and it's well-deserved. And, you know, all the accolades he's received are, are well-earned and, you know, he's a big piece of this team. So very happy for him. Well, nice accomplishment for yourself as well, being named uh, the coach for the All-Star game. Uh, pretty nice honor. Yeah, tremendous honor, um, you know, but all the credit goes obviously to uh, the guys in that dressing room and uh, my staff, my incredible staff, and most importantly to my wife, actually. She's uh, at home raising two little boys, a toddler and a three-month-old, and she's holding it down and letting me do what I get to do and, and, and love doing. So it's an uh, incredible honor, but you know, all the credit goes to everyone else. Looking to keep it going here tonight. What's the key to victory? You know, we got to come out and, again, keep it simple, uh, especially early. You know, I imagine they're going to come out flying, and so are we. So we're going to have to come out and just impose our will and our game plan and uh, stick to our structure. Once again, that's Steelheads head coach Everett Sheen. Sheener, as always, thanks for the time. Best of luck and have some fun tonight. Thanks a lot, Cam. Well, standing alongside Steelheads defenseman Matt Register, Reggie, a big night for you here, 500 ECHL game. Got 500 more or what? Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, my body's uh, feeling pretty good. It's holding up pretty good, so... Um, you know what, just uh, joy coming to the rink every day and, uh, you know, with my teammates and, uh, you know, we got a special group in there, so it's been a pretty special start so far. Well, when you hear those words come out of my mouth, Matt Register will play in his 500th career ECHL game. What pops through your head? Yeah, it's kind of crazy, honestly. Um, I mean, it's been a, it's been a wild journey. Um, you know what, I've had a, played on a lot of great organizations, you know, groups of guys every year I play with, you know, my teammates. And, you know, every year it's just it's, it's special to play. You know, it's a privilege to play this game. And, uh, you know, and I uh, come to the rink every day with a smile on my face and, and just, just have fun with it. Special little message earlier today from the ECHL commissioner as well. Yeah, I mean, it caught me off guard a little bit. But, um, you know what, uh, it means a lot to me, you know, just kind of uh, being recognized. You know, it's a, it's a huge individual accomplishment. But, you know, this is a team game at the end of the day. And, um, you know, I'm, uh, I just kind of want to... Um, kind of lead the way you know this league has uh, come a long way and um, you know what it's a great league to play in for young development and um, you build a lot of special bonds and relationships with guys so um, you know what every day it's just it's a privilege to come and play. You mentioned coming to the rink every day is a privilege it's been a f uh, tremendous start to the season for this club what's it been like to come to the rink obviously it's a special group. Yeah you know um, top to bottom you know Steelheads organization is just it's first class and um, you know, it, it means a lot still. I mean, uh, still to play and, and uh, you know, the guys look up to me and, um, you know, and I just want to uh, lead by example. But uh, yet I still have a lot of things to learn. So, um, you know, I've off to a great start and still a lot of hockey to play. And uh, we're looking forward to uh, getting back at it tonight here in Utah. We mentioned your accomplishments. Obviously, you've got a close connection with Everett Sheen, personal friend. Yeah. I know that. But uh, 
He mentioned earlier he saw you play in your first ECHL game. He's going to see you play in your 500th here tonight. But earlier this week, he was named one of the coaches for the All-Star game, and I knew uh, that was pretty special for you to see that. Yeah, I mean, it's been special to see his journey, you know, um, transitioning from a player to a coach. And um, you know what, he's uh, it's a learning curve, but along the way he's done a tremendous job and um, really happy to see him get uh, get named to the All-Star game this year. I mean, that's uh, it's a huge accomplishment for him. And, um, you know, we're all very proud of him, you know, at the end of the day. And, and uh, you know, kind of starting that journey off with Sheener is uh, – been really memorable. We made a lot of memories together, and uh, now he's he's the coach here. I'm the player, and um, you know it's uh, we got some unfinished business to do, me and him together. So, and this hockey club. Well, Reg, thanks for the time once again. Congratulations. Have some fun and enjoy the night. Thanks, Cam.